Welcome everyone back to the Home Ag Machinery North America facility in Grand Rapids, Michigan. Today we're going to take the time to introduce you to an operatorless bore and dowel insertion system brought to you in partnership between Styles Machinery and Automatech Robotic. Before we jump into the really amazing piece of the equipment, which is the robot, I think it's important to take some time to talk about controls on the front end. You can see that everything is visual and graphic and easy for your operators to understand and operate. At this point, let's take a few minutes to review the three main technical components of the solution. Off to my left, you can see the KUKA industrial robot with integrated vacuum end of arm tooling. In the center of the cell, that's a shuttle table system that's designed to receive the parts from the robot, then move them underneath the clamps on the drill tech machine to one of four zero points on the drill and dowel inserter. And then back off to my right is the dowel insertion machine itself, custom integrated into that shuttle table system. The machine is the Homeg Drill Tech D200. So here we are at the infeed of the work cell. As you can see in my hand here, a sample part with the barcode. All of the data for the cell is commanded via barcode. There's a section of small infeed rollers here and an overhead inline scanner. As the parts transfer into the cell, the overhead inline reads the barcode and queues up all the data necessary to move the workpiece through the dowel insertion solution. So here we are at the outfeed conveyor section of the machine. What's important to understand here, conveyance in, robot process, conveyance out. We're set up here for a kind of a temporary showroom install. In most cases, both your infeed and your outfeed conveyor sections would be extended to provide for queuing of parts from your, from your upstream process. It could be a saw or a CNC, as well as your downstream process, which could be destacking or potentially queuing parts for an edge banding operation. It's important for us to come away with a strong understanding of why something like this is created. Why would it matter to me? When we think about industrial robotics, in most cases, the, the default answer is speed, right? And in this case, you're gonna see lots of speed in the system, but in the context of integrating a robot to a dowel insertion machine, the answer is consistency. If we think about how a dowel insertion machine operates with an operator, with a set of hands. The machine sits for about 40% of the day waiting for something to happen that's out of its control, meaning the operator moves apart from one end of the machine to the other. The operator goes through the mundane process of file, open a program, actuate a program, push button, or uh, step on foot pedal to start machining cycle. And in worst case, the operator sits waiting for parts from an upstream process to be received at the machine. With a solution like this, those waiting cycles for which the machine can't control are minimized in that program is automatically called up by the barcode system on the machine. The robot moves the parts consistently through the dowel insertion machine at the same rate every single time. We're able to drive the consistency or effectiveness of the dowel machine upwards of 90% from the 60% that we typically see in a manually operated system. Thank you for taking the time today to become familiar with the operatorless drill and dowel insertion cell brought to you in partnership between Styles Machinery and Automatech Robotic. For more information, please contact your local Styles Machinery sales engineer.